Summer and I are getting ready to cook something for you guys today. We downloaded this from the Fancy Feast website. Did you shake off your hat? It's full of recipes that were inspired by Fancy Feast cat food and made into human recipes. So let's see what we've got here. I wanted to pick out something that wasn't too complicated because Summer is not a very experienced chef and she doesn't have a lot of patience in the kitchen. She tends to walk off in the middle of stuff. So I chose this white fish and asparagus with beurre blanc. As you can see, the ingredients for this are really, really super simple. This is gonna be for two people. It's definitely not for a person and a kitty because it's got some ingredients that aren't really kitty safe, but they're definitely human friendly. We're using five ounces of cod cut into two pieces and Summer is really interested in this. We've got a shallot, and yeah, that's not a cat-friendly thing, but I like shallots. A half pound of asparagus, a cup and a half of dry white wine. I got this can of Pinot Grigio from Trader Joe's, which is 375 milliliters, which amazingly enough is pretty much just about a cup and a half. We almost forgot the most important part, which is the butter or the burr because it's beurre blanc. And of course the requisite uh, salt and pepper to taste. Summer, your hat's on crooked again. You can't be a chef if you can't wear the hat right. Cause it's all about the hat, you know. There we go. So let's get cooking. We put the asparagus in a pan, the splash of water, cover it and put it on high heat. So here we go. It just takes a couple of minutes for the asparagus to get steamed and turn bright green. So once it's done that, we just put it on the plate and put it aside. Now next we add the wine and we add the shallots and we bring it to a boil. Let me fix your hat. There we go. Now that the wine's boiling, we're going to lower the heat to medium low and place the fish in the wine. Now we're going to poach the fish in the wine for three minutes. Then we're going to flip it over and continue to cook for another three minutes or until the internal temperature reaches 145 degrees. So Summer, do you think I'm doing a good job so far? So we're bringing the wine and the shallots back to a boil and reducing them. We'll see you in a bit. And we can start adding the butter a few chunks at a time. And the sauce is just about done. You just need to maybe add a little bit of salt and pepper. And it's ready to assemble. Some of your hat's falling off again. Come on, we need to fix that. Okay, here we go. And here's the finished product. We did a great job, didn't we? It looks pretty nice. High five for a job well done. 